Yasa Ziggy here and welcome to GRTV coming to you from Inner Rush Cafe here in Melbourne. Here's what we have for you on this week's show. Tonight, Con and Tina visit Hoyt's Melbourne Central for the Melbourne launch of My Big Fat Greek Wedding 2 and also catch up with some celebrities, including the star of the movie, Nia Vidalos. We take a trip to the USA for our weekly instalment from New Greek TV. Then we finish off with GRTV Kitchen with Tina Sophos from Four Doors with another delicious dish from head chef Nick. Let's cross over to Con and Tina at the launch, the Melbourne launch of My Big Fat Greek Wedding 2. Welcome to tonight's segment. I'm with my co-host Tina Sophos. And I'm with Con Laz. And we have been invited by Universal Studios here in Australia yes, yes. to showcase the opening, the premiere opening of... My Big Fat Greek Wedding 2, number 2. Exactly. And we can't wait to go and see what this movie is all about. Apparently, it's the sequel to the first one. And you know what? I can't wait to meet Nia as well. We've yes, got a special guest appearance from Nia herself. So has come all the way. From Canada. So, on that note... I've got my cake and my wedding already. Let's go and see what some people have got to say and what this movie is all about. Congratulations on the new film. Thank you, Tina. What inspired you after 10 years to write it? The truth of the matter is that my daughter, my real daughter, uh, finally came into my life and I knew that now was the time to write the sequel because the thought of her going away to school, to college, breaks my heart. And that's when I know I'm actually my own Greek parents. So you're trying to tell me that you've got qualities like your mother and you always said to yourself, I do not want to be like my Greek mother. That's what I would say. No, you're wrong. No, I should move out of the house. No, I should go off on my own. And now I'm going, oh my God, I was so wrong. And I'm trying to keep my daughter so close. Talking about mum, what did mum and dad and your parents say when you wanted to be an actor as a Greek girl growing up? That is like... My dad. I would say to my dad, I want to be an actor. And he'd go, ne, you can be a teacher and you can teach acting. <laughs> It's like all parents, you say you're studying arts at university. Did he say, why you do this to me? Did Absolutely. I said, this is what I said though. I said, you know, um, over 500 kids auditioned for this professional theatre school and they only take 25 and I'm the only Greek. And then he went, not plus be that you more. Tell me. He was proud, a proud Greek. Tell me, um, are the usual suspects in this sequel? The entire original cast is back for my big fat Greek wedding too. Oh wow. Everybody. Wow. Fantastic. Mm. Greek weddings are the same in Canada as they probably are outside of Greece, everywhere else? Everywhere else, yeah, especially here in Australia. I have Australian cousins. Nick, your thoughts about my big fat Greek wedding? Are I can't wait all, to see it. Are they can't all the same? No, no, not at all. I can't wait to see it. You know, it's very hard doing sequels and uh, uh, her, her cousin Peter just told me it's better than the original. Oh, yeah? Yeah, so I can't wait. Her cousin Peter actually lives in Sydney. He introduced himself to me tonight. And um, so there's a long, strong Italian, uh, Greek connection, Australian-Greek connection with Nia's films. Oh, wonderful. Yeah, her family lives in Sydney, Australia. And she's That's from Winnipeg, Canada. Look, you know what? We're all from, uh, our parents migrated to America, Canada, Australia. We all share similar experiences as uh, first, second, third generation kids of migrants. So look, there's a lot of crossover in the material and the humour. We're in Melbourne, you know, the capital of... Uh you know, the cultural capital of Australia, you know, the second biggest Greek population outside of Greece itself. And, you know, we're celebrating, you know, world Greekness because, you know, here's a girl originally from Canada, uh, made a huge mark in America and then a huge mark on the world. And that's what us Greeks do, don't we? No matter where we go, we leave a mark. I think it's fantastic. This is a, a we know it's a comedy. We know it's a Greek comedy. And of course, we've got Greek, Greek tragedies, but we also, are very fun people and I think this movie it's a light movie and uh, anything that can promote the Greek the Greek spirit the Greek character I think is a very positive and thing our sense of humor. and our sense of humor <laughs> we are funny people so what do you think of the movie thus far look it's amazing it's amazing production so I'm really looking forward to seeing number two it tells a simple story about family and the uh, the hold that Greek families in particular have on us yep. um, and the love that they give us and the price that they exact for that love. You know what? In the end, it's all great fun. It was a great film. Thank you. What do you think of the 
show. I absolutely loved it. I laughed so hard. What a brilliant, what a brilliant movie. Loved it. It's uh, like looking in a mirror. That was the best. I thought that, honestly, I thought the first was good, but that was fantastic. It was fantastic. Fantastic. Can't believe it's taken 15 years for the second one to come out. I love it. I thought it was absolutely fantastic. You know, I it was so different to the other one, but I think a lot of the emotions, I think all of us can feel. Um, I really, I thought it was cleverly done, um, and it was nice to see the characters grow, um, and it was a laugh, which was um, most important. So yeah, I, I really enjoyed it. Yeah, yeah, stole the show. She was it for me. I loved it. It was so funny. It was great. Yeah. What a movie! Lots of laughs. Get out and see it. This is a cracking film. It was so fantastic. And now you're coming tonight, oh, I could die happy. Fantastic, what a great movie. You get a telephone, tele, telegram and tele Greek. Guys, you have to come and watch it. Fantastic, great movie. I loved it. Oh, it was a great movie, fantastic. Really worth a watch, definitely. There was nothing that they could have done it better, so. All of Manassas loved it. So <laughs> we loved it, really good. Exciting and very proud to be great. Very enjoyable, good entertainment. Yeah, excellent. It was so good, so good, so funny, just like my family. <laughs>I'm still laughing. I thought the first movie was great, but you know what? Number two, absolutely hilarious. I can't get over the fact that the Yaya, who's probably about True. 100, True. must have come out of retirement, is still with us in the movie, and the fear. She is yeah. actually the Amazing. make and the take. On behalf of GRTV, till next time. Feel like ya, and do come and see the movie.